Hello guys, we are back with our next tutorial. In this tutorial, we will be seeing all about energy spectral density. So, an ESD, energy spectral density is defined as the distribution of energy of this, of a signal per unit bandwidth as function. ESD is denoted by this symbol of F. So, that is nothing but energy by unit bandwidth, right? That is equals to E by delta F. So, which is indirectly is equals to x of f whole square whole square. So, this is nothing but x of omega, right? I hope everyone remembers that in previous we had discussed about that. So, where e is nothing but integral minus infinity infinity psi of x into df is equal to 1 by 2 pi integral minus infinity infinity psi of omega d omega. So, if it may be in terms of f, it may be in terms of omega. This will be the total energy in energy spectral density. Okay guys, so now I hope everyone got a small idea. So, if it is in autocorrelation, the autocorrelation of an energy signal, it is ESD for a Fourier transform pair is Rxx of Z is for that Fourier transform is psi of F or psi of omega. So, now I hope everyone is now a bit familiar with energy spectral density. So, in the next tutorial, we will be going through power density guys. We'll be going through power density spectrum and power parsimus theorem for power and few more okay guys let us meet in the next tutorial thank you thanks for watching